A local woman says she had a disastrous experience on an American Airlines flight. Thanks for joining us tonight. I'm Jamie Sherrod. Day Janique Cannamore lost the use of her legs last year. So when she planned her trip to Florida, she said she made sure the airline knew to accommodate her. But as she told TV5's Kate Nadolski, her trip was anything but smooth. My dignity was taken from me. Dejanie Canamora Flint says humiliation doesn't even begin to describe how she felt after an incident with American Airlines this weekend. I was stripped of my human rights and for all of them to like hover around me, it was almost like I was like an animal in a cage. Dejanique suffers from a rare autoimmune disease and as a result became a paraplegic less than a year ago. This weekend, she was coming back from a trip, flying from Miami to Detroit with a layover in Chicago. She says the trouble started when she was placed on the plane in the exact seat she paid for, adding that she let the airline know of her limitations months in advance. When I got in the seat, I ended up being on an aisle seat. The two couples came by, they're like, can you move? I'm like, no, I can't move. He's like, so you're just going to sit there? I'm like, no, I'm paralyzed. I physically can't move. That's when the man got the flight attendant. Flight attendant came back to me and she's like, well, can you move to the window seat? I'm like, I can't physically move myself. Dejanique says the flight attendant kept asking her the same question and wasn't able to help. She says she was then left in a bad situation, feeling completely helpless. Other passengers started to chime in saying that people like me shouldn't be able to fly. And one lady even said, if she can't move or she can't do it herself, she needs to get off the plane. She needs to go because she's holding us up. After the chaos settled, the flight took off for Chicago. But when it landed, Dejanique says the nightmare wasn't over. First, they didn't have enough help to get me into the seat. So I had to stop everybody else from getting off. So, of course, they really got upset and they started making more comments. Dejanique says two other passengers had to help American Airlines employees get her off the plane. And she says the employee who was assisting her with her wheelchair in the airport was putting her in danger. I was rammed into seats. I was dropped twice and my body started to slide out of the chair because I physically was not strapped in right. She says her feet were dragging the ground, causing bruising and swelling. She spoke with a representative from the airline that day in the airport and says that she was offered an apology and this meal voucher. That doesn't give me my dignity back. That doesn't take back the things those people said to me. That doesn't take back the fact that I was literally drugged down the aisle. We reached out to American Airlines about the situation. They gave us this statement reading, quote, We are concerned about Miss Canamore's comments and we'll be reaching out to her and our Chicago team to get more information. We'll follow this and keep you updated. In Flint, Kate Nadolski, W1EM, TV5.